Might be raining, but nothing is dampening the enthusiasm or the sunshine of the week for Marcus Willis. Marcus, have you come back down to earth after last night? Not yet, no. Still floating. Um, yeah, no, I have. It's just, yeah. just hitting some balls and it started pouring it down. But I'm used to this. It's, uh, it's Wimbledon, isn't it? Did you manage to get any sleep last night? Were the events racing in your mind? Uh, no, not at all. As soon as I put my head on the pillow, I was, I was done. I was tired. I mean, it was just amazing to watch how you captivated the, the, the watching crowd because as the match went on, I don't know whether you were aware of this, more and more people were crowding round. They were leaning over, even in the posh seats, as it were, they were leaning over to, to get a look. 19 break points, you saved, and, and that game in particular where you came back from Love 40 down on your serve was massive, amazing composure. Yeah, um, I got myself into trouble by, by missing a bit too much, um, really switched my mind on. But yeah, I was very clutch yesterday. Um, I'm going to need to be a bit more on it if uh, I'm not going to save 19 break points against Roger, I don't think. But I'll try and not get myself in that hole in the first place. And are you aware that, that he's come out and said that your story is brilliant and he said this is what tennis needs and, he, and he's glad to be a part of your journey? That's, that's quite some uh, support from a 17-time from a Grand Slam winner. Yeah, I know. It's, it's very kind of him to say that. Um, I'm obviously honoured to be on the same court, court as him, but... I've got to go and try and beat him tomorrow and, and get the job done. Well, look, thanks ever so much for, uh, for stopping for a couple of minutes to talk to us in the rain. We are very much looking forward to seeing you tomorrow, whatever court you're on. Have a great one. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate. Cheers.